Hello everyone, welcome to a new video of the plugin series in which I create a plugin that can generate an entire simulator game. Um, this video is part 4 and I've added reverse. So I'm going to show it to you real quick. So this works for clicker games and for collector games. Uh, you click reverse next to the settings one, it works uh, on the right too. Um, and you just click until you can afford a reverb. The default price is 100 and it um, increases per reverb. And I'm now getting two per click. Uh, three. It um, multiplies uh, your, in your uh, how much you get. So uh, in this video, I wanted to add some. Uh, new things to reverse. For example, I wanted to make it so you can get a bunch of different uh, default requirements and maybe a reverb boost. Uh, I need to check. I'm, I'm gonna start with the requirements because that will make a lot more combinations possible. And I'm gonna get some people to try it out, give feedback, and then depending on that, I'll add more. Alright, everyone. So I've made it so the reverb prices can be 75, 100. Or 125. Um, this triples the amount of possible games. Um, so instead of 1600 different combinations possible, there's now 4800 different combinations. So uh, that's really good. So here you see reverse. Now, the good thing about this is that you can also edit the prices yourself. You can go to the reverse base price here and you can change it, for example, 15. And then it should um, change the cost to 15 so yeah it costs 15 goes to 30 and then just doubles so that's pretty good uh this should make the game a little bit more interesting it's still a pretty boring game uh so i really need you guys feedback on what to add so yeah, i'm gonna try to uh, come up with some stuff to add to this and then uh, once I added them, uh, I'm going to show you guys. Alright everyone, so I've added um, the, a reverb multiplier which is random. So it can be times 1, times 1.2 and times 1.5. So yeah, right now I'm getting 2.2 per click. Yeah, I'm getting 2.2 per click, I think. No, uh, 2.4 because I have a reverb. Uh, actually no, I don't have reverb. So it's is broken right now but i'll fix it in a second but um i've added that so the reverb multiplier can be randomized and uh, now that also triples the combinations because you can have games with 1.2 1 and 1.5 1 so it's gonna be a little bit more different so i think i think that's good and that changes the total amount of combinations possible for this game uh, up to 14,400 because uh, 4,800 times 3 is 14,400. So that's pretty crazy. We started with 1,600. We already uh, multiplied the combinations by 9 by just adding reverse. Yeah, so I'm going to fix this bug real quick. But I'm going to end the video here because I don't really know what else to add. So if you have any suggestions, anything for the next video, then make sure to tell me or comment your ideas, uh, like the video, and uh, yeah, tell me if you're enjoying the series.